Alright, so in this video I want to talk about resource packs, uh, how to make resource packs. So what they are essentially is just texture packs and sound packs put together. Uh, so if you're used to the normal texture pack method of changing the textures in your Minecraft game, it's changed since the 1.6. And uh, so now, so they have now what's called resource packs and resource packs also can ch uh, contain changeable sounds as well. So to make one, you're going to start out by going to percent at data percent. Uh, dot minecraft and resource packs create a new folder and you're gonna name this whatever your resource pack is gonna be called so I'm just gonna call it pack one and then inside this you're gonna create a new folder called assets and inside assets you're gonna create a new folder called minecraft uh, now you're gonna want to go back and go to versions 1.6.2 open this with WinRAR or 7-zip or whatever program you use uh, and then look for a file called pack and you can just type in pack uh, real quick and um, it'll automatically find it for you but we can see right here just drag this out and go ahead and go back to the resource pack folder and go ahead and drag that right under assets and this tells the game that uh, this is a resource pack so now once you have this set up, you're ready to start adding your own textures and sounds. Uh, so I'll just start out by adding some sounds. So I'll go to assets here, uh, and then copy whatever things I'm going to want to change. So if you want to change the icon, you just copy that. You don't have to copy everything, just copy what you're going to want to change. So I'm going to change one of the records. So I'll copy the, re uh, copy the records folder by either right clicking and going down to copy, or just uh, holding control and hitting C. Uh, then go to resource pack, pack one assets Minecraft, and then control V or right click and hit paste. Much easier to hit control V at the same time, and that'll paste it here. So now we have all the names of the uh, music disc in the game. So I'm going to go ahead and delete 11 because this is the one I'm going to re replace. Um, all the all the sound files in this game are .ogg. The, the file extension is OGG. Uh, so I have an MP3 of a song here, and I'm going to have to first convert it before I put it in the game. So you have two options here. You can go in a program like Audacity or uh, Aud Adobe Audition and export the file as an OGG. Or if you don't have those, you can just, there's a website here I'll have in the description, and you can just drag and drop whatever uh, file you want and then click convert file it'll convert it for you and then you can download the OGG version this won't give you any viruses or anything and it leaves the original completely alone alright so now that we have our OGG version of our original song we can go ahead and go back into our resource pack in the records folder which I have open here and drag in our new song now before I decided I was gonna change music disc 11 which normally just sounds like a bunch of weird sound effects and is like a minute long. So, since I decided to change that one, I want to make sure I rename my new song exactly what it was originally. So if you're changing, let's say, Chirp, and you drag in your new song, make sure you call it Chirp, so that it replaces it. Um, so I have that in there, and now everything is in order for us to go ahead and make sure it's working. So in Minecraft, go to Options, Resource Packs, and you'll see the pack you made right here. Select it, click done, and go ahead and open a world. Alright, so now I'm in a world. I have my jukebox right here. Here, this is music disc 11. Go ahead and put it in and uh, make sure everything works. Alright, so that's pretty much it for sounds. Uh, if you're changing like sound, or if you're changing music that plays automatically, or um, sounds in the game like sound effects, it's all the same process uh, as we did here. So for textures, you're gonna go ahead and go to the version, uh, and then open just like we did before to get the pack file, and in the assets, Minecraft. Uh, you can see it's just like what we had before. We have the assets folder, then we have the, like just what we uh, created in our resource pack. We have the assets, inside that you have the Minecraft, and you have all the textures and stuff. So you can just highlight all these, or 
I mean, you can just highlight whichever ones you're gonna change. Uh, font is all these. Some of these like um, these are a little bit not really something you tend to change. So really, you just need to copy the textures, uh, the textures folder. So I'm gonna just copy that, and then I'll paste it into my resource pack in the Minecraft folder. So now we see we have textures here, and here is all the textures in the game. So the most common things you'd probably change is in the blocks, and we have all of these. So all you gotta do to change them is it's super simple. Pick a, any texture, bricks. Um, edit them with your favorite image editing software. Now I made bricks look weird. Hit save. Now I have my edited bricks, and if we go in the game, uh, let's see. go in the game now. I'll go ahead and just reopen my texture or my resource pack to refresh it and look for bricks we can see now bricks are what I made it alright so I hope this was helpful for you guys if it was it would be cool if you could leave a like and maybe check out some of my other videos um, if you have any questions feel free to leave a comment or send me a private message and uh, thanks for watching